Whether it's record breaking or just plain bizarre, we take a look at the top 10 human powered machines. The weirdest and one of my personal favorite machines starts off this list. The mechanical device is composed of a three dimensional triangular frame which moves along with the user and acts as a huge walking robot. It's actually the only human powered exoskeleton made so far, but with powered stability, software, guidance, and a little more speed could morph this machine into something that's really crazy. Nevertheless, it's still really impressive and empowering for being a human powered machine. At number 9, the Washu Zan Roller Coaster. One of the strangest roller coasters is also human powered, and not surprisingly, it's yet another attraction based in Japan. The carts act as tandem bikes, and you pedal over four stories of doom while only wearing a seatbelt. Now, it's probably one of the slowest roller coasters in the world, so there's plenty of time to enjoy the view, and even though the carts can hold up to two people, it's best to be in shape before strapping yourself into a cart. The park is also not liable for any injuries incurred from crashing into other carts. At number 8, the Strong Based Bike. A new type of bike is purely based on showcasing its design, and it will probably not be replacing your ordinary bike anytime soon. Finalized in over 700 hours, the machine looks half alive as it jolts across the street. The Strong Based idea is nothing really new, and it's been used on very large scales by Thiel Jansen, who's built large wind propelled machines which walk themselves across a beach. And he also plans to make herds of these mechanical marvels to take over the world one day. At number 7, the human powered ornithopter. This bizarre machine flies by flapping its wings, and it's also the first aircraft of its kind. The ornithopter is composed of a Kevlar fuselage and a carbon fiber frame, which makes the craft only weigh 250 pounds. The wings are also set up in a lower angle so that it has positive lift and thrust when moving up and down. The whole thing is controlled by a leg press drive mechanism, which ultimately pulls the wings downward and makes the craft fly. The longest flight only lasted for 19 seconds, so it might not seem that spectacular, but it did set a world record. At number 6, the Taniwa Submarine. A new human powered mini weapon is preying upon targets in the southern hemisphere. The Taniwa supports a crew of one, but unfortunately, it does not carry missiles or explosives. The pilot lies on their stomach head first and uses pedals to propel the craft forward. It sort of works like a bicycle, and the tail flexes through the water to propel the sub. There are also fans for controlling the depth of the sub, and it can also go an impressive four and a half knots. The pilot is kept alive by an onboard air tank, but the nine foot lightweight machine will probably not be scouting any deep trenches in the ocean anytime soon. At number five, the Edda Speed Bike. The fastest human powered bike set a new mind blowing record speed of 89 miles per hour. It's built off of carbon fiber and even has handmade tires, so the total weight of the machine is 55 pounds. The rider has no direct visuals and can only see through a small screen display, which would be a little bit weird to say the least, but it's required for maximum aerodynamic efficiency. The custom drivetrain also has two separate stages in order to keep the chain line as short as possible and maximize torque conversion. Now this company is always building next generation human powered machines, and I wouldn't really be surprised if they break their own record. At number 4, the Human Powered Elevator. A new hybrid elevator gets you to the next level in a strange new way. The contraption requires users to manually propel themselves upwards, so it's a bit of a workout. But the company that actually built the device claims that it uses considerably less effort than just walking on the plain old stairs. So is this machine really practical? Probably not, since it only accommodates one person at a time. I don't think this will ever be used in 40 story buildings, but maybe it'll be used for some custom houses for workout fanatics. At uh, number 3, the human powered monorail. Located in New Zealand and nicknamed the Schweeb, the monorail is a unique and crazy ride. There are two separate tracks which hold pedal powered pods, so you can race your friends in style to the finish line. The track is over 600 feet long and it is an enclosed circuit, so the workout races can be done in multiple laps until you get tired. The pods can also go up to 27 miles per hour and swing up to 60 degrees on the corners. For me, this is kind of like one of the coolest rides out there. And there are concepts for building a human powered monorail in different cities, so hopefully this idea can really take off. Now number 2, the Aerovelo Atlas. Da Vinci would be most certainly proud of this huge human powered helicopter. The colossal machine has a rotor area of over 13,000 square feet and an overall weight of only 121 pounds. Which also means that it's larger than a 737 jet which tips the weigh scale at 170,000 pounds. The machine is very lightweight thanks to its carbon fiber frame and polystyrene foam airfoils capped with balsa wood. The record breaking 1 minute flight was performed by one person on a built in pedal bike. It won the Sikorsky challenge and ultimately brought home the quarter million dollar prize. 
So the human-powered helicopter is very innovative, but it's unlikely that you'll ever see one flying over you. Uh, number one, the Winter Gaden Marble Machine. One of the most popular and ingenious contraptions ever built is also human-powered. The hand-cranked marble machine has a kick drum, bass, vibraphone, and an assortment of other custom instruments to evolve mechanical workings into brilliant music. The machine took over 14 months to build and can theoretically run for years on end. But unfortunately the machine will likely never go too far as it has to be completely disassembled in order to be relocated. Barnes also built quite a few other clever music devices. But the Winter Garten will hold this time in history as one of the most clever and unique human powered machines ever built. So once again, thanks for watching, please like the video and subscribe to my channel.